Hey guys, how's it going? Astroprint here again with another video. This one is the NIH National Institute of Health video and the partnership that we now have with them and the benefits that you can receive by going onto their site. Just so want to type in NIH 3D print into your web browser and it should take you to a page where it has their website where you can find us on. Let's click that right there. And basically the page has got a lot of things you can do on it as a 3D printer and developer. You can discover, share your prints, you can create things on here, you can learn, engage, and kind of just do anything you really would need to pertain to the medical field in 3D printing. So they have some special collections below that you can look at. Right now we're going to discover, take a look around the page. They currently have a little over a thousand models on the website right now and it's growing every single day. Um, it's got everything from viruses to bones to bacteria matter, some pretty crazy stuff on here. And it's all really helpful for not only doctors, but students uh, looking for an educational advantage by printing these out and really getting a hands-on feel of what they're working with. So right now we're going to look around, see uh, if we can find something to print. Got some labware for test tubes here. Some little add-ons, viruses. This heart looks pretty good. Let's try printing that out. Just want to click on that, and it'll take you to another page where it'll have more specifics on what you want to print. So this one has some general information of exactly what it is um, and the parts that are belonging to this heart model in particular. <laughs> A little information there, printer that you'd want to use for the best print, and the guy who submitted it. And down below there's things like ratings, comments, some more interactive stuff that we can get feedback from and improve these prints. So just go down this little arrow, point into the box, and you should see our logo right below. Click on that little box below it, and it'll take you to this page right here. And this is where you can import your design straight from the website. So once you sign into your Astro Print account, log into that. And there you go, it's imported and you can start printing. Just click the button. It's gonna take you to your Astro Print page. And this is where you can get a little bit more technical, where you can choose your printer that you wanna use, the material, we're using PLA. Gonna slice it, upload the G codes. There we go, and it's ready to print. And it has started printing, so I just want to monitor it now. Click on that, and it'll take you to another page where you can see basically everything you're doing. You can look at the time of it, how many layers it's gonna be, the temperatures. I'll customize that. And then the bottom left corner right here, you can choose how many pictures you want to print uh, to capture your model in 3D print. So you can do each layer. If you want to take a picture of each layer, one minute, two minutes, five minutes, whichever you want to use. And this is a three hour print. So we're going to do the five minute. And yeah, there you go. Alright, so this is our print three hours later. Looks pretty good all around, so let's say it's overall pretty successful print. Remember you can print yours too now at 3dnihprint.gov. So go check it out guys, really cool site with a lot of fun stuff. So yeah, this is Astro Print and we will see you guys next week. Thanks for watching guys.